So our EP was written, what, five years ago? Four, four or five years ago, and the title is Of Want and Wisdom, and one of the songs is Of Want, and it was probably the most popular song on that album. I mean, it's still, people still, you know, message me on Instagram, be like, I love your EP, that song Of Want, and I'm like, why, our EP's terrible, <laughs> but no, I'm just kidding, it's good. Um, it was progressive, too. Yeah, it was, it was, it was interesting. Good. Life. Um, yeah, I don't know what we're talking about, but... Of Wisdom was a song that we decided, like, you know, we should kind of tie in the last record into that. And Of Wisdom's about um, just kind of being in this place where, like, you know, you know, um, continuing down that path of hope and saying, like, you know, um, I can't necessarily see what's in front of me. Um, there's a lot of things going on in my life that I have no control over, but I'm going to continue to run towards um, the success and the things that I have chosen to do. And I think that applies to a lot of people in knowing, because a lot of people, I think they know like what's good for them, what's positive in their lives, and they know what's what's negative and saps their energy and you know what is toxic to them. So it's kind of like along that path of saying, okay, like no matter what gets in my way or what I can or can't see and what I can or can't control, like with anxiety or different stuff, it's like, no, I'm gonna choose to continue to fight for these things that I know um, are going to make me a better person and give me hope and you know joy throughout the day um, and you know stuff like that so I yeah. mean it was a good foundation for emotional viewpoint on everything where the whole record went to so that ending basically with that song as an actual like song song it was a very good I guess progression to end it on with all of our all the lyrics that was written out for it especially relating back to what the song was in the EP. Yeah. Fun, fun, fun music. Fa fun fact though, uh, we ran, went into the studio, that was a partial song. We were just like, okay, let's just bring this in there. And our producer, um, engineer, Andrew Bayless, he's in a band called Nine Shrines. He used to be in a band called Life and Repeat. Super dope, bro. Um, and he basically just, I gave him the idea for the song with Chris and David and Josh and he wrote, sat down, and he was just sitting there in the studio, which was the living room at his house in Maryland, and he just tabs out the drums in like 10 minutes, and he's just sitting there playing, and then 20 minutes later, you know, he's got the guitar and bass, and then so an hour after the song, we gave him the idea and the chords and stuff. He's like, what do you think of this? And he just pushes play, and it's like, oh, I guess we're just gonna copy. That sounds good to <laughs> us. So that's kind of how the song came about. It was fun, interesting.